Myers, Florida, and today I'm excited to tell you about a 2006 Hydrosports 33. And uh, this is a unique boat in that it not only has a center console and a hard top, but also has a cuddy cabin as well. You'll notice as we look up here on the bow, got a great uh, anchor windlass system up here on the front. And then as we look back towards the helm area, you'll see that the hard top has a nice walkthrough where we can walk right down into to the cockpit. Kind of got a forward cockpit area here with a neat seating area where people can sit, joyride, and um, enjoy the day on the boat. And then as we head back towards the helm, you're going to notice great in-floor storage as well as a dunnage box on the side, your battery switches and all in that box. Also notice got a great bolster set up here at the helm and uh, these will raise up very simply. So you've got a choice of a seat or the bolster to stand up in and run. This also has the zero effort shift and throttles as well as a great electronics package. Look at the dash with all these great gauges as well as easy to get to switches. This is an equipment room. This has the uh, Kohler generator over there in the corner as well as your battery switches for the thruster and the uh, generator. All the batteries are in here easily to access. Over to the starboard side, we've got great tackle storage. Neat little storage area here for either a cooler, uh, safety gear, or whatever else you may want to put in there. As you look towards the back, we've got a folding seat that will come up. Uh, you'll see in the pictures, makes a great place for people to sit back there and ride. We've got a great bait storage area. Nice cover as well as rounded corners. We always talk about that, recirculating, etc. Another great little area back here where we've got our hose uh, for washdowns. Great walk through here as we go through uh, to get to the transom and a ladder that drops down in the back. Also easy access for the bilge if we need to get to pumps or to seacocks back there as well. Got a great uh, big cooler here that acts as a back seat behind the helm seat. Mention that great hard top with the uh, rocket launcher rod holders there on the back. This boat also, you'll notice in the photos, has a great enclosure to keep it while it's stored either on the lift or in storage. So as we walk back forward, once again, great seating area up here in the front. We walk through up to the bow. And now we're going to step down into the full cabin. Now this not only has the generator, but it also does have air conditioning as well. Uh, I've got this bunk up over on this side so you can make a bunk there or it drops down to make the backrest. Right now I've got the filler cushion in but you'll notice in the photos that the table does come up here and you've got an area that you can sit around. Great flat screen TV. Hatches to let plenty of ventilation in here if you want or like we said it is air conditioned. Microwave. Master distribution panel. Got a uh, Great electric refrigerator. Stand up head with the vacuum flush potty. And uh, an aft cabin back here as well. Neat steps going up to the back area. This boat has uh, less than 500 hours on it, been recently serviced. Uh, the owner has had it out fishing and uh, using it. It's a really, really great boat. I'm Franklin Pillsbury with Marine Max here in Fort Myers. Give me a call. This is an outstanding boat. Uh, you'll notice the really beautiful dark blue hull. Um, Hydrosports was a great design boat and uh, has a lot of neat features to it. Give me a call.